You've had enough pain and crazy to last you a lifetime. You deserve someone who doesn't break like glass. I did the work here, but I'm not magically fixed. I can't promise that it won't happen again. I don't care. <laughs> I need you to call me. I need to hear your voice. I need to know what's going on. I thought it was your favorite. But it's yeah, the no, this is great. Thing Thanks. That I know. What? Nothing. She was my wife. We were married. That's my point. What am I? She had cancer. She didn't even know she was going to be able to after the radiation. No, don't do what? I have to get sick to figure out if you're going to go all in with me? And now you're going to go. Yes. And you're right. It's kind of none of your business. We keep this love in a photograph. <laughs> I'm gonna marry that girl. eyes are never closed. You got me. Hearts I swear never to broken. God. And time's I'm forever frozen and still. So you can keep And if it's okay with you, I would really like to take your last name. Because I've never had the last name of anyone who's loved me. You won't ever be I got your account. I'm such an idiot. I love her. Loving can hear. I love you. <sighs> Loving can mend your soul. My dad, he he was like your ex. I'm not like that. Right? I'm not like my dad. I, mean, I do I do things that are wrong. I do things that are stupid. But I swear it will get easier. I swear to you, I would never hurt you. Look, all that crap I said about building a life here and about putting down roots, look, I meant with you. I want a house with you, my career with you. It's all supposed to be with you. I love you. And I love living with you. We should have our own place. Just us. I never said that. Said what? I love you. I didn't think that I had to. Alex Crow. <laughs> Will you marry me? <laughs> Wait, so that's um. Nope. Whoa, well, listen. No, you listen. You don't tell people about me. You don't talk about me or to me ever. But you and me. You and me? What you and me? You walked out. You left. And I came back. And then you called me trash. You just you said it so easily. You were trying to hurt me. It worked. We're the only family we need, right? And we'll be together forever, right? You and me. And if we have kids, we'll be great. We'll be a great dad. You'll be great. And it'll be just us. We won't need anybody else, okay? Like you. You're not trash, Joe. I love you. You? I didn't know. No, I get it. You're taking her side again because she is your priority. You don't get to tell me what my priorities are. Under the lamppost back on 6th Street Hearing you whisper through the phone Wait for me to come home